Uh, I really like our cornerback group over any receivers that we end up having to see. But our guys are really good, and I don't really see too much of a challenge with anyone. But it's a lot of competition on the field, and we know that their guys are going to always give us good smoke whenever it's time to. But it's not one specific guy that I see just having a crazy day on the end of us. I can see all of us balling with anybody in the country. And obviously, you know, the defense on this team seems to be a huge bright spot going into the season. Um, you know, has there been this vibe at all that, like, maybe there's some pressure on the offense to step it up to that same level? Or, you know, what is that, I guess, what is that dynamic? Uh, I don't really see too much pressure. Our offense really knows what they got in that room. And our guys have been working a lot this summer, this winter. And we really know what we can bring out there. And we know what we got in the front offensive line. And we know what our quarterback can do. And we know what receivers we got in that room. So and our running back room is crazy. So like, we really got no doubt in them. And they never had any doubt in themselves. Just got to go out on the field, compete, and be who they are. Yeah, and obviously, you know, DJ is a known quantity, but he's been putting in some work in the offseason. You know, what have you noticed different about his game this year? He lost about 20 pounds, and he's moving. He yeah, he's, he's, a, he's, he's something different now. Like, he can run around, he can do different things, and he's putting it there anywhere at any time. And DJ could probably do anything now. Like, he's a good player. Defending the spot. I'm guessing you've gone up against Antonio Williams. Yep. Has he, uh, has he gotten the best of you yet? Would you admit that? I won't <laughs> say that. I won't say that. But he's definitely great for a young for a young player coming in. He's a great receiver at a young age, and I can see him in the next three, four years being a top guy in the country. He's a he got a good motor to him. Also, he loves to compete, and he won't back down from anybody. But I like I like him at receiver. He can play some special teams too. What makes him difficult? I don't know if it's one thing that I'll say make him, makes him difficult, but he's real good at making people miss mm -hmm. in open space, and guys better make sure they get hands on him before he gets loose. Have you gone up against Jake running school in slot? Yeah. What, as a pass catcher, what are his strengths? His size, definitely, and he knows how to use it. He boxes out smaller guys a lot, but if you don't know how to play with bigger people, he'll really take advantage of you. But Brittany Stu definitely has great routes for a tight end. The best routes I've seen for any tight end, really. He can move very good, and he loves to compete. He loves to block. He can do a lot. On that, on that same note of talking about the slot, it seems like Cole Turner 